Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I decided to do a January's favorite video. And this is not just makeup, it's everything and anything basically. To start off, I was going to do my favorite book of the month, which was Fat Dad and Fat Kid by Shay Butler and Gavin Butler, which is his son, his name, Fat Dad and Fat Kid. And I absolutely love this book. Like, it has so many tips in, like to help you stay motivated and what you can do to help lose weight. And I loved it. It's such a good book, and I recommend you guys getting it and reading it. I got mine on Amazon on sale, I think, for like... Seven, eight dollars, but you could also get them in bookstores, Amazon, and a lot of other places. But I absolutely loved it, so I recommend this book a whole bunch. Second thing that it was is my favorite movie, and Netflix released Pride and Prejudice onto their website, and I'm obsessed with Pride and Prejudice, so that is my movie of the month. Like, I loved it so much. I've been obsessed with, like, Jane Austen movies, but Pride and Prejudice has to be my favorite. Another thing I've been obsessed with, my favorite songs or stations is Sabrina Carpenter on Spotify. Love her. Can't Blame a Girl for Trying might be one of my favorite songs right now. So, definitely one of my favorites. Another one of my favorites I've been listening to for a while is um, Disney's Pandora. I know, I'm a child at heart, but Disney Pandora is definitely... Another one of my go-tos. Um, I'm going to move on to food and drinks items. So one of the first things I found and I'm obsessed with, like seriously obsessed with, I've been going sugar-free the whole month of January. And at the very end of it, I found sugar-free cookies. Like, from the dollar store. And I was like, I don't know how I'm going to like these because I got them from Dollar Tree and didn't know if they were going to be good quality because... Sometimes they cannot be, but these are seriously so good. Maybe it's because I didn't eat sugar for a whole month or what, but I love these cookies. And I looked them up on Amazon trying to see if I could find another, like, recipe because they come up with, like, so many, like, lemon, almond, coconut, peanut butter, oatmeal, chocolate chip, pecan shortbreads, chocolate walnut, pecan chocolate chips, oatmeal, chocolate chip with pecans, strawberry coconut cake, strawberry raspberry cakes, brownie, and chocolate mint. Like, those are all, like the cookies that they come in and I was like man that's good so I went to look on Amazon for them and six bags of these were $15 or one bag was like three ninety something and I got two bags for two dollars at Dollar Tree and they're both chocolate chip because I ate the I bought two before I ate both of them in like less than a week which is bad but Sorry, it was, I got the pecan shortbreads, and they were good, too, like, I was surprised about these, but these might be one of my, these are, like, my favorite go-tos right now. Another thing that I've been liking, I'm not, like, obsessed with them, but I've been eating because I think they're healthier than potato chips, is veggie straws. And I have this huge bag I got at Costco for, like, four bucks, but they're good. They taste almost like potato chips, I think. And they're better than, I think, than having, for me, like, potato chips sitting around whenever I'm, like, editing videos, doing homework, and things like that. Something else, I, since I've cut out sugar, I've been trying to also drink a gallon of water today. So my favorite drink has to be water. And the past, like, week, week and a half, I have not drank a gallon of water. But for a good three weeks, I drink a gallon of water a day. Which is a lot. Um... So, my sister is gluten-free, and we found this at Kroger, and it's a bag of gluten-free baking and pancake mix. I was looking at the ingredients to see if there was any sugar in it, and there wasn't, and I was like, seriously? So, we got this because she did it, but I decided to try it because my mom made cookies with it, and she said there was this nutty taste to it, but I think it's because there's almond meal in this, so it tastes delicious for waffle and since I'm not 
having sugar, like I said, um, a hundred percent pure maple syrup does not have like refined sugars in it. It's just like a hundred percent maple syrup. So I allow myself to have this and um it's delicious to go on top of the waffles. So that's what I got also. Um, another item that I've been obsessed with is natural creamy peanut butter. I got this at Kroger because I realized I was going to let myself have sugar and peanut butter, but the more times that I let myself have it, I crave sugar more. So I decided to even cut the sugar out of my peanut butter. And that's why I got this, and it's good, except if you don't stir it very, very extremely well, when you get to the bottom, like I am, the peanut butter is like how, whenever you give dogs peanut butter, like, that's how it is for me right now with this. Okay, moving on next to, like, clothes, and, well, this is accessories, and I guess clothes. Um, the first thing is crocheted headbands, like the winter headbands, and my sister got me this one for Christmas, I don't remember how long ago, it had to be, I want to say my sophomore year of high school, so that, how long ago was that? I don't know, I'm in sophomore college, so like four years ago, so, she got me this, and I love it, and my mom, before I went out to college in Idaho last year, made me this one, and I wear them both because they're just nice, and they keep my ears warm, um, another item that I like is my sister made me this hat for Christmas last year because I went out to Vegas before I went out to college and I went out there Christmas Eve so she made me this for Christmas and I love it it's like a slouchy like hat and it's so warm and it's so pretty and I love the colors so thanks Jonna um another item I'm wearing them so you can't really see them but they're like the jogger pants so they have like pockets in them but like the bottom has elastic that's like this thick so it's like tied around your ankles and I love them because they're so comfy and the plus side is they have pockets it's so hard to find pants like <sighs> pants that are comfy and look nice I guess you should say they have pockets um another item I got these because I wanted to try them at Dollar Tree also because Dollar Tree by my house just opened, which is bad for me because I love going into Dollar Tree and getting stuff to make crafts and stuff. Is But I got these, and they're like the stretchy, elastic-y, cloth-looking headbands and I, elastics, and I have one in my hair right now because apparently it's just to help, like, not break your hair off as easily in a ponytail so you don't get all these little, like, tiny little pieces in your hair. Another thing that I've been loving are these headbands. I got them from Rue 21 and there's two others which I think I did not grab and I see one right now but I'm not going to go get it. And I love doing this just to put in my hair or for I do a twisted look that's up so it's out of my face that I love using also. On to um, just some random items is my friend got me this Burt's Bees Candor in Lavender Fields and it smells like florally but I like it and I put it by my hamster because I don't want my room smelling like hamster all the time because hamsters can stink so I put this I don't light it I just set it open because to me it works like an air freshener so I just like sit it down under by my hamster like this um, another item that I've been obsessed with since I've been drinking so much water and I have sensitive teeth to water which is weird um, I have my camelback, and it just helps, like, so it doesn't, like, touch, like, the water doesn't, like, go in between my teeth and, like, cause them to ache. But I had a different one that, um, I used for over a year, and it start this part started not being able to stay down. It would just pop up, but that was from, like, normal everyday wear and tear, so can't get a replacement on it, but I love my camelbacks. Um... On to makeup, because who doesn't love makeup? Because I love makeup. That's going to fall. Um, I got this first item in my Ipsy glam bag for January. And it's a Hey Honey Lifting Eye, lift, Open Your Eyes Eye Contouring Lifting Fluid. And what it does is they just put it like a, the tiniest little bit right here underneath my eye. And it like firms 
it and like smooths out like because I have like lines underneath my eyes and it, like tightens them up and firms them and makes your eyes just like look awake and fresh. Um, another item that I've been loving is this Bare Minerals Flawless Definition Mascara. My sister got it for me for Christmas. And it's just a mascara. The bristles on it are shorter, so it just like helps separate my eyelashes so it's not all clumped together or I have a problem with that a lot. Um, another item is this I've been using, I've been putting makeup on, which I haven't recently, is this Bare Minerals Original um, Foundation in the color medium. And I love it because it just helps, like, not make it look like I'm wearing makeup, but just kind of, like, because I have, like, red spots, like, on my cheeks and my skin's kind of blotchy. It just is nice to help cover it up some. I've also been using um, Bare Minerals Prime Time. Can you guess? And I've been loving it because it helps stick it on. But one thing I want to try is the Nivea's Men's Sensitive Aftershave Lotion type thing. Because apparently it's supposed to be really good. Um, and then I also been using the mineral veil after I put on the foundation to help my powder stay on better longer. I um, the next item I love lipsticks, but I don't wear them enough is what I should say. But um, my friend for Christmas got me this um, Kate. I think it's by Revlon. No, it's by Ramel. And it's in the color Rosetto 05, but it's a cake color. And I love it because it's, it's red, but it's not, like, red. It's like a pinky red, I should say. Um, another item that I've loved, I got this also in my, was this my January or my December Ipsy bag? I think it might be my December. I don't remember. I got this in one of my Ipsy bags. And it's the Mark Anthony Hydrating Coconut Oil um, Deep Nourishing Conditioning Treatment. And I love it. And I haven't used it in a while, but I've used it twice. And there's still, I can see the liner here, this much left in it, the bottle. So it was like a nice size sample, and it's very nice. I love it. Um, something, if I don't wear makeup, or I just want to look like I'm more awake and don't want to put mascara and stuff on. I will usually just put on a little bit of white eyeliner. I have no clue where this came from. I just had it and I just put some on my bottom of my waterline to make my eyes look bigger. And maybe not look as tired as it may be. Um, I've also, since it's the winter time, and my lips have been getting so chapped. I've been using my, um, EOS. That's what they're called. And this one's almost gone, and I couldn't find my other one, but I think it's in my purse. Because I have two. But I'm so proud of myself for actually almost using a whole EOS egg. I think that's what I'm most proud of my accomplishments for. And on to my next item. I'm going to do... Um, if I ever put on eyeliner, I don't know why I can't use the pencils. It has to be like a gel eyeliner. And I've been using the e.l.f. cream eyeliner. I'm just using one of my uh, eyeliner pencils to, not pencils, brushes, to just help put it on my eye line. I must put my whole eyelid, but not that. And so, um, I'm going to go on to brushes. And... Um, this is a Bare Minerals brush, and I loved it, because some of my other brushes I've had for a while, but this is newer to me, and so I, like, love it, because it's so soft and so nice, and puts the foundation on so much quicker, and I've also been loving when I put on my, like, liquid foundations, or, like, creams. I use a mousse foundation. I don't know if they still sell or not, but I love it. it is this Beauty Blender. I've got it to try it out, and... I've loved it so far. Um, I guess I should go into like jewelry items and like nails. And this is 
um, Revlon Color Stray Gel MV in the color Card Shark. It's 100. My friend got it for me for Christmas also, and I loved it, and I use it all the time. It's on my nails, but it's on my toes because it's such a pretty color. Um, the earrings, I love, they're earrings I have on right now, which are tiny little earrings that I love. And I've been wearing them constantly. The other ones, I either wear small tiny ones or like huge diamonds like this. I don't really think there's an in-between, unless it were like, I have some Claire's earrings that I wear every once in a while. But these are my other favorite earrings that I've been wearing recently, and I've been loving them. And so, that is it for my January's favorites. I told you it was going to be a variety of different items and things that I use all the time. So, if you guys would like to know where I've got any of these items, let me know down below. And if you want to see what my February favorites are next month, well, we've seen it this month. So, my February favorites for this month, let me know and I'll make a video for that too. So, thank you for watching my video, and I hope you liked it. <laughs> Bye. You want me to ask AC? Yeah. You want me to film you? <laughs> you cute little boy. You just came up to me, and I asked AC, and then they want to make a video.